um, and I think that. Sorry, Coco. She was asleep. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to film a fashion haul because a couple of weeks ago um, when I was packing to go to Singapore, I was packing and I was going through my wardrobe and actually realised that I don't have many clothes anymore. Because when it was winter I donated a lot of summer clothes that I don't wear anymore to charity and now that summer's come around I actually don't really have much clothing left. I said to myself when I get back from Singapore I'm going to go shopping and buy some new summer clothes because London is getting quite warm now and it's getting to the point where um, I can actually wear t-shirts and vests and, and really summery clothes like that. Um, so today I went shopping and there's a few things that I bought in the past two weeks as well. Um, I've been back from Singapore for about over a week now and this is the only day that I've had, actually had time to go shopping and I just have literally got back from the shopping mall and I just sat down to film a video before I put it all away in my wardrobe. So, I'm going to start with Urban Outfitters. So in Urban Outfitters I bought um, this jam, is it a jam jam? It's, it says to go jar and it's got a straw in as well and it's just unscrewable like that and I thought that would be really good for my smoothies and my fruit juices that I make in the morning and I don't have anything like this and it just makes it so much cuter to drink um, yeah it looks really cute and it just looks like that and that was £12 and it is glass it's not plastic so yeah I really like that and I can't wait to use it then I've got some black lace shorts. By the way guys, I actually had the intention of going shopping for colour. Um, I wear a lot of black, white, grey, neutral colours like khaki. Um, I actually wanted to inject a little bit of colour to my wardrobe this summer but I just didn't really see anything that I liked and was colourful. Everything that I liked was um, black, grey, kind of neutral colours but then I did get a couple of coloured pieces so don't be disappointed. Well anyways, I've got these shorts and these were £38 which I think is pricey um, for a pair of lace shorts but I really like them and I haven't seen any um, elsewhere so I just bought them and it's like this and I really like how it's layered so the bottom is um, just some shorts and then the top layer is the lace so when you're wearing it you can actually see the lace on the skin, like on the hem, and I really like that. So that was £38, a bit expensive, but I really need some new summer clothes. And then I got this t-shirt, which was £28. Again, a little bit expensive, but um, like I said, I need to really update my summer wardrobe. And it looks like this. It's kind of like a cropped top with rows, and then it's got like grey mal sleeves like a three quarter length sleeve. I really like the proportions like the three quarter length sleeve and then the cropped um, and I just think this would look really good with just a pair of jeans or even just like a skirt and yeah it's jersey material so it's kind of like a t-shirt material. I'm not actually sure if I'm going to keep this because I think that £28 is a bit expensive for this. I can imagine finding something very similar in Forever 21 for about £15. So um, yeah, I'm, I'm not sure, I might try it on and see, if I love it then I'll keep it, but if not, it's going back. Then I went to Mifa Island and I got these tops, um, uh, the like, kind of like a really string, really thin spaghetti straps, like a really loose fitting vest in um, Mifa Island and it comes in a lot of colours and a lot of prints. Um, I obviously bought a black one because I love my black and it was £14 and it looks really nice because um, I really like the front section like this so that it just really flatters the chest, not that I have much chest anyways but it, it just really flatters the chest and it's really loose and flowy and it's perfect for summer and it's a simple basic piece as well so you can really dress it up or dress it down. And because I liked it so much, I got it in this colour as well. And I think that this colour would be good if um, I have a tan. Um, again, £14. 
just looks like this and I think it's such a good bargain for £14 because it feels really nice quality it's not like a jersey material it's more like a I don't know like a silky silky chiffon type of material and yeah again another one and actually I wanted to get it in another colour they have like a periwinkle blue colour which is really really nice but they didn't have any in my size so I might go back for that like another day and then in River Island I also got this top which was £25 and what I liked about it was the colour I absolutely love this kind of like a bright blue colour and then the paisley print on it is just really pretty and what I like about it most is the dropped sleeve um, it's actually coming lower than a normal sleeve so you'll be able to see kind of like um, a bit of side and the back is buttons so it's not restrictive or anything and I'm actually planning to take this on holiday I've got quite a few holidays this year um, honeymoon of course and then my friends getting married in Dubai so I'm going to be going to Dubai so I need a lot of kind of uh, what am I saying I need quite a lot of summer clothes this year because I'm going to be going to hot places and then nothing else I just got the hangers as well from River Island I should do because it saves me from buying more hangers. I went to a top shop and bought my favourite, favourite jeans ever. These are the Journey jeans and J O N I. And I have these, I ha actually have two pairs in black, which I absolutely wear to death. That's why I have two pairs because the first pair faded really quick because I wore it so much. Um, and I was like, I love these jeans but I don't want to always be wearing black jeans so I've got it in like this dark grey colour it might look black on camera but it's actually like a charcoal grey colour so um, yeah and I wore these a lot in Singapore um, it was really humid and hot but luckily we went in the sun for too long we was in and out of cars so it's okay to wear these and these are really stretchy really thin almost kind of like a jegging and the high waist as well so it's really nice when you wear like crop tops and then I also got speaking of crop tops I got a couple of crop tops I got this grey one I actually got it in a size bigger because I didn't want it to be too um, clingy on the body I want it to be a little bit loose so I got it in a size bigger and these were £8 just like a ribbed jersey cropped top and they do it in a lot of colours I'm sure if you've been into Topshop then you've probably seen them and I got it in this um, again like a I'm not sure it's kind of like a periwinkle blue colour so that's really nice and really simple I'm trying to buy more simple pieces because what I find is every time I buy prints I don't wear them again after one season just because it's it's almost as if like I've worn that before. It's really obvious. It's really print. The colour's really obvious. And I just want to buy more basic pieces so I can keep wearing them season after season. And oh my god, whilst I was checking out at the top shop checkout, I came across these. They sell these in Top Shop now. These are so hard to find in the UK. I've actually never seen them before in a shop. Um, but Top Shop now do them. £4.50 for a bag, pretty pricey, but when they're so hard to get hold of, I don't mind paying a little bit extra just to be able to eat them. This is nice. Mm. Do you want one, Coco? I bet you do. Then I went to Pink, um, which is Victoria's Secret, because I needed a top for the gym. Uh, I just wanted like a, like a vest like a loose vest so I just got this really basic one it was £19.50 which is a lot of money for a basic vest but I gathered that if I have really cute gym wear it will motivate me to go more well that's what I'm telling myself but anyways this um, kind of like a neon pink vest for the gym so I have more cute gym clothes now and then I also, of course, I went to Victoria's Secret and I was thinking whether I should show you guys these but then I was like, every girl wears bras which girl doesn't wear a bra? so I don't mind, I'm just going to show you and bras from Victoria's Secret are pretty damn expensive these were £40 each and that is like the most I've ever ever spent on a bra but I've heard really good things and if it's going to make my 
boobies look a little nicer <laughs> then I don't mind paying the price and it's quite important anyways because it's a foundation of the outfit and also having a good bra in general is for good health you don't want to be wearing the wrong size and you don't want to be wearing a bad fitted bra that like suffocates you or anything like that so I went for two black ones because I wear a lot of black clothing and I think that these are um, more versatile when it comes to wearing like strappy tops say if I'm wearing like a pink strappy top and I have a black, black bra strap I think that's kind of acceptable but when you have like a white or like a really nude colour bra strap it's so obvious that it's a bra that is not very nice <laughs> anyways I've got this black one and it's got a little bow on the front and then it's got lace on the back and I got this one which is just um, cotton but it feels so so soft like I think it's silk jersey it feels like silk um, but it feels so comfortable and yeah it's just a really basic one but the fabric oh my god this fabric actually let me try and see what it is 71% nylon 29% elastane so yeah, nylon, but it feels really, really good. £40 for two bras. Yeah, not sure. So then I went to Sara and actually got this one in Singapore. Um, I got this top in the Sara in Singapore. I'm not sure how well that's coming across on camera because it's got a layer of chiffon. But if I lift that up, you can see all the um, crochet detail underneath. But it's like a cropped, layered white top. And I thought that was really pretty and... Um, great for summer especially because it's white and I don't have any white things in my wardrobe and then I got this play suit from Sarah as well uh, by the way this was about £40 I'm not sure how much it was in England but because I got it in Singapore it worked out to be about £40 which is expensive for a top but it's really nice so I, I don't mind um, and then I got this um, play suit which was 20 £25.99 and it's this navy lace layered one and I don't own many play suits and I don't own any many lace and I don't own many navy items so I thought this was kind of justifiable and it's like this so it's got shorts at the bottom lace shorts and then this is actually quite loose obviously you have the body underneath and then this one just hangs loose and I thought that was just really simple and really cute and just really easy to wear, especially when you're having a lazy day in summer and just want to find someone for find someone, find something and throw it on. And then last but not least, I got um these sandals from Sarah. I wanted some comfy light coloured sandals, but I wanted something with a little bit of a heel. But now I'm thinking if it's gonna have a little bit of a heel it might hurt my feet because I'm so used to walking on platforms and um, whenever anything's really thin it really hurts my feet so I got these kind of like platforms that have some white straps and they were £19.99 so I thought that was quite good for £20 like £20 for a pair of sandals that's really good especially for Simon as well so I just bought them and I think that sorry Coco she was asleep I just scared her um, but yeah I think that these are going to be really good for holiday and um, just general everyday wear really they're going to be comfy it comes to the end of my haul Woo! and yeah um, I think I still need to buy a few more bits and bobs probably more skirts and shorts for summer and um, maybe like a lightweight cardigan but other than that yeah I'm quite happy with everything that I've bought here this video guys again thumbs up if you liked it and I shall see you in my next video bye well, actually, um, let me just go and find my um, check-in desk and, and luggage. Oh, I am looking.